Hey YouTube, this is Dean making another vid. If you like my content, please consider hitting the like button. So please consider subscribing as it is very much appreciated. Father's Day today here in Australia. So I wanted to do a happy Father's Day to all the fathers, which I am, as well as to my father. So happy Father's Day. As is my way, I tend to do fires for that. So let's get on to it. As is my way, I also do fat wood fires and buy flint and steel usually. So let's do that. Won't be seeing Dad today because he's away visiting relatives. I think he's in Mandubra at the moment. So I won't be able to say in in person, but let's do it by, via video. Happy Father's Day, mate. As Dom says, don't be stingy with your char cloth, which I am not being. That striker, I'm really impressed with it. Is that new one I did yesterday? Some nice Bunnings fatwood. Did a big heap of it. Yeah, that's the first one I have. Um, I actually quenched the strike plate. So yeah, first one I ever quenched. So it sparks really well. Um, yeah. These pocket bellows are good for keeping your face away from the char cloth as you're blowing it into flame. You've got to be able to develop enough heat with the, um, with the char cloth, obviously, to get it to go into flame. Probably didn't need to use so much charcoal. I think I had about four pieces in there, but yeah, two two would probably do it. But you, you can never be too stingy with it as far as that goes with this sort of stuff. Um, you've got to develop enough heat to be able to get it to go into flame. Otherwise, it tends to burn up. Especially with this, um, I'm I'm using t-shirt at the moment. It tends to burn up very quickly. while it catches a spark very well. And it does, it, it is superior to um, denim in that respect. It, um, it does tend to um, burn up a lot quicker than denim does. I think um, denim personally has the best ratio of robustness and burning ability for all the char cloths, ability to take a spark. But each their own. As far as it goes, use whatever you works for you. As with anything like this, it's it's always you go with what you work what works for you. No one's a real expert in this sort of stuff. That's um, P 
people who say that they know better than you, as far as this goes, they're just being arrogant. It's and it's silly. They think they um keyboard warriors. They, that's just stupid. Putting people other down, people for it, and that yeah, it's just silly. I didn't mean this to be off a rant. I, don't, I shouldn't do that. Um, yeah. Happy day. Celebration. I know why I'm segwaying. I, I was reading some posts and a bloke got me down. So anyway, that's, that's just the way it goes. I needed the fire. That's what I needed. It's a good day. Happy Father's Day, everyone. Anyway. That budding stuff is really good. I always had, had success with it. Continually impressed with it. I'm going to have to cut some more off. I'm down to half a bag of it. I like having lots of lots of the stuff cut up, ready to go, so I can experiment with it, play around with it, have it have it always on hand. Getting some, um, I've got another contact, another bloke on one of the forums contacted me. I might be able to get some more fat wood too. So yeah, got the feelers out. Anyway, that's getting down to it. So happy Father's Day, everyone, and this one's going out to my my old man. So happy Father's Day to you too, Dad. Thanks for watching, everyone.